hello again it's those Gillerys and today we have unboxing the bazaar all three packages so let's start with the sheet pack the chick pack <laughs> the banana package the chicken banana package <laughs> so these are for October <laughs> okay no nice guy I'm just gonna rip it because it doesn't want to open right or maybe I'm just keep fried chicken <laughs> yeah Chicken. Mom. <laughs> okay. First thing I see is an Alice in Wonderland wallet thing. That's really cute. Oh look, you need a new wallet. Yeah, here you go. It's kind of big, but yeah. <laughs> if that's what it is, it looks like it. Let's see. Yeah. So it's a cool wallet. It's big though. So for people that like big wallets, it's really cute though. Okay, so let's see. That's for National Mad Hatter Day. Alice in Wonderland wallet. We all know that Mad Hatter from Lewis Carroll's Alice in Wonderland. The artwork originally was all done by Sir John Tennell for Carol concerning the Mad Hatter. Hackbird Dasheries made their hats with mercury and prolonged you generally drove the hat artists insane. While we view this as hum humorous in Alice's world, I doubt it was the same in the real world. The 10 six on the Mad Hatter's hat probably stood for the price of the hat, 10 shillings and six pence. However, if you look at most of the characters in Alice in Wonderland, it's interesting to think he may have been one of the most sane citizens of the land. Suggested ways to celebrate, dress up like Mad Hatter, read Alice in Wonderland, pretend to be Alice. Okay. So there should be three more things in that pouch. Yeah, rose pouch. Rose pouch, and I keep getting pricked on something. On a rose thorn. Oh no, you got pricked on a thorn. On the pouch. Oh no. And then when I got pricked on Aurora's crown. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Oh, I pulled two things out on accident. Oh, you back in there. Okay, so this was what was pricking me. It's cute little pumpkin earrings, and I can't wear earrings, but they're cute! So, I'll show you the camera these because it's like kind of hard to see because they're small, but these are really cute pumpkin earrings. Mm -hmm. National Pumpkin Day, enamel pumpkin stud earrings, October 26th. The pumpkin has become a symbol of fall, Halloween, and Thanksgiving. It seems like pumpkin is made or put into every kind of food or drink imaginable. My favorite is pumpkin pie. Pumpkin is, is actually a squash, okay? A really big squash and is believed to be native to North America, perhaps as old as 9,000 years. Seeds have been found in Mexico that date back to 7,000 BC. Today is celebrated by carving pumpkins, building machines that throw pumpkins, and in chucking pumpkins, if that is such a thing. So just a way to celebrate. Visit a pumpkin patch. Make some sort of pumpkin dish for your family. Plant pumpkin seeds. Wait for the pumpkin dish. Angry Birds is here. The maze. Oh, uh, really? Uh, yeah. <laughs> That's cool. Uh -huh. I like the corn maze. I thought it was so funny that one year where they gave us the wrong direction, so we were going around in circles for a long, long yeah. time <laughs> until we figured it out. Yep. This is. I don't know which one it is. It must be this. I think it's this. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. World Sight Day Seeing Eye Anklet, October 10th. Oh, it has little eyeballs on it. Today we celebrate our gift of sight. Not that life can't be as valued if one has no sight, but to get up every morning and see the day we have been given, also a gift, should bring you joy. The idea of the day is to encourage people to get eye exams, and that is a good thing. Sometimes we take our eyesight for granted. Over the years, as it changes and blurs, you do need to get corrected. You wouldn't want to miss those sunrises or sunsets because you didn't take the time to make sure the world really was as you saw it. They say beauty is in the eye of the beholder. Beauty is there whether you see it or not, so make sure today you have the opportunity to see it for as long as you... Oh, okay. I guess as long as you can. So. It's just as long as you, yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. Alright, suggested ways to celebrate. Get an eye exam. Look closely at things with the idea you may never see them again. Check your prescription for your glasses. I don't have glasses. I got my glasses a year ago and I, I used to have emails glasses telling me to get own. more. And I'm like, no, 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 no. I have I have good vision, guys. 
I mean, I'm just what? clumsy. That inspired me to make the Hope it's Gets Glasses so really video. Because I got my glasses around the same time as I got my Wasp costume. Okay, so this is a smile necklace. <laughs> <laughs> so it's for World Smile Day. Let me show you it and then I'll read about it. Mm -hmm. So it's a necklace with a smile, smile. on it. <laughs> smile Day. Okay. So. October 4th, World Smile Day Gold Chain Stainless Steel Smile. If the entire world smiled at each other, it would be a much friendlier place. <laughs> Harvey Ball created the basic smiley face in 1963, but it took until 1999 to actually make the day one of the world's most would day the world would celebrate. It always falls on the first Friday in October, just in time for the coming holiday season. Not all smiles are meant as friendly, however, so you need to watch the person smiling at you to see if it's real or not. <laughs> watch, don't, don't think the Joker's smile was friendly. Yeah. That may make it an entirely different place. <laughs> I mean, they may make it an entirely different place, but we should give a smile to all who see anyway. It may give someone a boost they might not get otherwise. Suggested ways to celebrate. Smile at everyone you see today. I will tell you whether the smile is actually genuine. Not a cover-up for another for other intents. Always return a smile with a smile. Hey, honey, smile at me. I don't me. like your smile. <laughs> 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 okay. So, Chris, you can start the next box. <laughs> I'm gonna hurt my jaws. Uh oh! Don't crack your jaw out trying to smile weirdly. <laughs> my jaw likes to pop out of place. Oh, one time I got my jaw stuck open. Yep. I had to pop back into place and that hurt. Probably said having hyperflexion, your joints and stuff, like jaw and arms and stuff, and okay. hips pop out. So this is the Biblioteca box. Okay. So, there you go. Grab the book and then read the thing about the book on here. <laughs> For the description. She. Wade borrowed the motorcycle diaries. That's on a Latin American journey. I probably mispronounced that. So this is for the motorcycle day. So she's gonna read the description to the book. Show me the book. So this is the book. The young Che Wade Barra's lively and highly entertaining travel diary, now a popular movie and a New York Times bestseller. This new expanded edition features exclusive unpublished photos taken by 23-year-old Ernesto on his journey across the continent and his tender pictures. preface by Adelaide Guevara offering an insightful perspective on the man and the icon. I suck at pronouncing names. <laughs> <laughs> you are terrible. Go back to school. All right, so I'm just <coughs> sitting there. Because in school, a you don't know how to pronounce people's names. Yeah, sometimes it shows a motorcycle. So, oh, oh, I thought it was going to be a motorcycle on there. It looks like it's going to be a mug going on it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so it's a motorcycle mug. All right. So, which farm am I reading? You can go ahead and read. That way, the top okay. white thing. October 12th. Always celebrate the second Saturday of October. Today marks the end of motorcycle riding season. According to experts, as we put away our motorcyclists for the colder weather. The day also marks when Dunlop tires developed the first tire that became practical to use on a motorcycle. Hence why Chad Gear Dunlop tires created day in 2015. For I live, motorcycle season never really comes to an end, but then they aren't as much fun to ride either. There is something about the mountain and forest to make a motorcycle ride all that much better. So take your cycle out for one more ride before the season ends and enjoy the wind blowing through your hair. Okay. <laughs> I want to ride a motorcycle with Thor and put my what hands is, in the What if you're bold? <laughs> so this comes with one more thing. thing. This box comes with three things. I want his hair to blow in my face while I'm riding a motorcycle with him. I will be behind right. him and I'll put my hand. Phew. <laughs> his armpits. Okay. I'm not her. So this is a motorcycle picture frame. <laughs> 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 
or one picture of you and one of your motorcycles. Motorcycle. <laughs> yeah, a picture of you and your motorcycle because you don't want your friends with you on the motorcycle. <laughs> so then he comes over to your house and wait. No, I wouldn't because you, if you have no friends. Friend, yeah. Oh. There's someone that you're trying to make friends with. <laughs> Suggest a ways to celebrate. Take your motorcycle for a ride. Dangerous. Get a sidecar so you can take a friend. Join a motorcycle club. Learn about the chopper. Learn about chopper the biker therapy dog in San Diego. Okay, so that was the big little tech -a box. So Chris, I guess open a new box oh. again. <laughs> so, uh, here you go. I would only ride a motorcycle if Thor was on it. Okay. I'm sure he would kidnap me. Nope, we just go for a fun Get ride. Get on, girlfriend. We're yeah. going to Asgard. Rides up to the Rainbow Bridge. Bridge like, Yay! Yay! Hi, Dulcie's like, come, he's like, he's bringing a human again. Doesn't even say anything about the motorcycle. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Doesn't care. Just, but. He has a human with him. Yeah. Okay. Okay, it's something to suffocate. You better get it out. It's a dog. It's a try me. I sing and move. Oh, okay. okay. So this is the original box. So it's, it's like the parrot, I guess. Oh, oh my gosh, you see yeah. copyrighted music. Oh, oh Christ, it says born to be wild. I'm thinking Christ seems born to be wild. Uh-oh. <laughs> it's okay, go ahead and play. start singing over it. Oh, no, nobody will be able to hear it. I wonder if that's what it sings. Uh, yeah, it sounds like the cats are starting to fight. I think you pressed the arm right there. Oh, yeah. Because there's a dog nearby, yeah, that's, that's why. Fun. Years old, she got her star in All Star Comics number eight. It's Princess Diana of Themyscira. Among her special powers are super strength, voice impressions, and ability to turn really nice circles. For them. <laughs> she also has her lasso of truth. It seems our early heroes had to come from another planet where they were normal, but when reaching Earth, they suddenly had superpowers. It seems to be a pretty common theme with Superman having advantages over our weak human. But what isn't weak about us, Orphans, is how rich we made the creators of these fictitious characters. Mm. The just way to celebrate. Find some Wonder Woman comics. Watch the old reruns of Wonder Woman. Create your own new superhero. Looks like they're different patterns because that one's slightly different. Oh, yeah. Ooh, we didn't yeah, Wonder Woman's like hundreds or thousands of years old. I mean, she's an old lady. And I'm not going to be watching the sequel because I didn't like the first movie that much. Oh my gosh! You Mm -hmm. Oh, looks like a fire truck. Okay, this little thing left that black oh. right there. Okay. But let me open this up and show them. So this is a cute fire truck. It has like a thing on the bottom. Maybe it's a bank. <laughs> okay, so this is the fire truck. So let me move some of this back here. So it's a cute fire truck. Oh, it's a tow truck. Is it a tow truck or fire truck? I think it's a fire truck. It's FD, so fire yeah, it's department. a fire department. Yeah, I was like, wait, okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's red. Okay, National Fire Pup Day, Ceramic Fire Truck Bank. Okay, October first. So that's tomorrow. Today we celebrate the fire pups that are not only our best friends, but in many cases our heroes. In the 1700s, the Dalmatian was used by the wealthy to protect their carriage while traveling. The dogs would run along alongside the carriage, protecting the contents when it was stopped. 
In the 1800s, the Dalmatian was used by fire departments as it was found they calmed the horses used to transport the fire equipment. Well, we don't use horses for fire engines anymore, but Dalmatians have stayed in use as a mascot for the fire department, along with other breeds, and they still help with search and rescue. Suggested ways to celebrate. See how many fire stations in your community have a dog. Read about the hero dogs that have saved people. Adopt a doggy. Okay. okay. Now when you oh, have one, we have one right yeah, here. Got, there we go. We adopted oh, one. Okay. Exactly. Okay. There's one thing left. It says, I don't like morning people or mornings or people. Uh, I say that sometimes. Oh gosh, that's Adrian's plaque. <laughs> This is Adrian's I do not have a desk, so I would have National Grouch Day. Yeah. Desk sign. October 15th. We all know them. Some of us may even be one of them. The Grouch of the Day. Normally this is unacceptable, but for today and today only. Um, day of your day, it's okay to be a Grouch. The day has been celebrated since 1976 and supposedly came from Sesame Street's Oscar the Grouch. Could be, but I think there have been grouches for a lot longer time than that. <laughs> I think a lot of the grouchy old men toy. that are older than that. A grouch can be funny if you watch them and think about what they are grumpy about. In most cases, it's nothing at all that makes them that way. It's just who they are. Well, enjoy your grouch, love them, and listen to them complain. After all, they won't be around forever. <laughs> Suggest <laughs> ways to celebrate. Record a grouch so they can see how silly they sound. If you wake up grouchy, go back to bed. As if I have List that option. all the grouches you know. <laughs> oh, I God. have a grouchy character. His name is Malcolm. Uh, Cam. Me. Okay. <laughs> okay, so this was a cool boxes. So if you liked this video and like the stuff, please give us a thumbs up. And to watch more unboxings from us, remember to subscribe to our channel if you have not already. And thank you that those that I have. See you later, guys. Bye-bye. Born, born to be wild.